What's going on YouTube? It's your boy Cool with Cool Kicks. I'm at the Jetman LA store, aka a uh, Foot Locker flagship. Yeah, and the reason I came here, I did I did win a raffle for a metallic four. I think it's a red one. Let's go look around and then yeah, let's go do a pickup, do a little review, see what happens, guys. You guys are familiar with the store. The store um the vlog from this place did really, really well, so yeah, let's look around, see what deals we got, you guys. Dang, so they barely got any retros now. That's hella crazy. Last time they had a bunch. Last time they had a bunch. All, all they got are these Animal 3s right here. Got these mids. And then those mids right there, That that's kind of about it, wow. All right, they got this too. They got the sevens, the hair sevens. And that's it, you guys, that's it. All right, I keep saying that's it, but yeah, they got these bad boys. These are going for a buck twenty. Normally, they went for a buck sixty, I believe. And these are the ones that have all React on the bottom, so should be pretty comfortable. The upper looks way different though than the traditional Jordan One Low. Then they got the all black Jordan One Low tumbled leather, looking pretty nice. Then they got the all white version right here. And that's about it. We saw these at the Nike outlet last week, and yeah, they're going for retail here. Dang, that's crazy. So not the greatest selection. This is the first time I've ever come here and they don't have that many retros. This is like, this is the worst trip ever. God dang. They do have a couple sales in there. These are going for 129 instead of the 160, the Spizikes. They don't look too bad, not too bad. These are going for one, these are going for 130 instead of 175. I didn't know these were 175, holy cow. 139 instead of the 70s. I'm just wondering if it's even worth even going over all these. These are not retros. Um, I don't want to be elitist, but I don't know. Not too many Jordan lovers are looking for any of these things, right? Right? These look a little small, but these are pretty dope. Going for a buck 50 instead of the 170, so there's a slight discount. This one does have that different material on top. Suede right here. Has that uh, satin material right there. Got. Got that Italian leather up top. This is jersey material? What is this, like jersey material? <laughs> and then, then it does have patent leather and tumbled leather on the toe box. That's pretty dope, you guys. I think this might be the dopest thing here because they don't have much. Got one more low in the women's section. We do got a couple of mids. These are all going for retail. This is going for 90 bucks. And then $90 for these. I hope you guys can hear me. It's loud as hell in here, man. This is like total club atmosphere. Do got a few things in the women's section. These are going for a buck ten. Buck ten, not too bad with the little snake skin. Different colors, not too bad. I think the kids section does have the most heat. Oh, actually, wait. That's a women's shoe right there, but that's a kid's shoe. I don't know, I'm confused. I'm confused. 130 for these, this is in the kids section. These only came in the women's, but yeah, this mid, this is one of the mids with a really good quality, because yeah, it's got that suede, that super nappy suede, and then, and then nice, nice, nice leather right here. Go for retail though. I'm not too big on the style. It kind of looks like they dipped this. I think they, that's what it's called. But yeah. 140 for these bad boys. Man, I can't wait till the grown ups go on sale. These are going for $80. But that's, that's kind of about it, you guys. They do got the Island 13s out right there. Got some fours. Man, that's about it, you guys. That's about it. You know I'm a fan of this stuff right here. Whatever's on sale. Last time it was 75% off. Got the XLs. We got the exclusive LA Jumpman hoodie. They go for 75. Last time they were 75% off. All, all XLs right here though. I feel kind of dumb because I should have got one of these shirts. Dang it, they only have XL now. I don't know if they have any smaller ones. If these go for 70% off, that's $10. That's an XXL shirt. Or, these are both double XL, man. Dang. I was a fan of this one last time. I go for 100 bucks, 30% off. This is a double XL though. Then they got a few of these long sleeves. These are all 70% off, so the prices are kind of crazy. But the sizes are kind of crazy too, because they're all XLs and above. 
But yeah, this one's going for 60 bucks. So yeah, it's 70 percent off. That's only 18 dollars. Not bad. All right, this might be a shorter vlog, but yeah, let's go pick this up, take a look at it compared to some of my other fours, and let's see what happens, you guys. All right, we did make that purchase, you guys. Take a look at these real quick. I did get a size 10. I don't know why the hell I got a size 10. But yeah, man, looking good. Let's, let's take a look at it close when we get home, you guys. I am wearing the black hats, you guys. Jordan 13 Black Cats, super, super dope. Was able to find it for hella cheap on Mercari too. Not bad though, not bad, huh? Great condition. All right, that was super interesting how they didn't have that much of a selection. They barely had any retros. And I talked to him and and he said recently they just, people came in and bought everything. That's hella, that's hella interesting. I, I, thought, I thought they would always have some retros and they would always have some of the hype stuff, but apparently not apparently not you guys they're kind of like every other sneaker shop don't forget nike outlet pr promotion right now is 40 dollars off 150 bucks you can't stack that with other discounts if they do have any so make sure you guys go check that out and for any of you guys that do resell or are interested in reselling make sure you guys go hit up my boy uh, know it to flip it he kind of specializes in that does make super interesting videos so make sure you guys go check that out all right so i've been walking around for like 10 minutes you guys and if you come to downtown la remember remember where you guys parked the car because Holy crap, I was tripping out, man. I walked off for at least 10 minutes. All right, we are back in the office. We are back in the sneaker room. And yeah, we got them. These are the metallic fours. These are the orange colorway. And and yeah, I'm, I'm actually really amazed by these, you guys. I really am. Yeah, they definitely utilize really good material. They definitely made sure that the quality is extra high on these. I don't know what to say, guys. These are just amazing. The leather is just super duper soft. You know, there, there are a few things that are different from most other fours. The fact that this side piece right here is made of leather. On a majority of the fours, this part is normally plastic. That's kind of what the fours are known for. The lace locks on the top and the bottom, they do have a metallic appearance. I don't think they are metal. It does look like it's coated with plastic, but it does look really dope. The fact that it is metal and the fact that it is very shiny because most of the other ones do have a matte finish and, and they are made out of plastic. Um, the fact that the back right here, it is a Jumpman in the back, but it is kind of a chromed out orange Jumpman. That is pretty dope. When you look at the tongue, the tongue is a orange creamish color, which is kind of dope. I definitely didn't see that coming. Most of the time that is plastic. It is made of leather for this pair. So um, yeah, I'm, I'm really pleased with these, you guys. I'm really pleased. Um, I definitely intended to grab these, uh, do a review on them, uh, take a look at the store for you guys, and then resell them. But the quality is just amazing on these. And, and I wouldn't be surprised if I ended up keeping these because these are pretty insane. These are definitely insane. Um, I do have quite a few of the fours because the fours do tend to be my favorite silhouette. The fours and the threes. The only thing I do like better about the threes is that the tab on the back does not rub against your heel. When I'm sitting down and I, I, I lay really, really far back, the, the tab does rub against uh, the back of my heel on occasion. It's pretty rare, but it does happen once in a while. The closest thing to this in quality, I would say, it are these what the fours. The leather quality on these are amazing. Um, there are a few things that I actually prefer about this. The fact that, you know, the lace locks are metallic looking. The fact that the back is chrome. Um, yeah, there's a few things that I actually do love about this. I actually love the color scheme, the colorway of this one to be a lot better. But um, after seeing this, I kind of wish all this stuff wasn't plastic and... And I kind of wish this was also leather as well. But everybody does love that Nike Air tab on the back and, and also the cement colorway, that type of stuff. So, um, you know, I'm definitely happy with both you guys. I'm definitely happy with both. So yeah, so um, all in all, these are amazing. These are amazing. Like I said, I definitely intended to 
to resell them when I first got them, but I may or may not keep them just because I love the fours. And there's just so many things that I love about this this pair. And the fact that these are so different from so many of my other fours, it might force me to keep these. So um, yeah, we'll see what happens, you guys. All right, guys, thank you so much for making it to the end of the video. Hope you guys enjoyed that review. I hope you guys enjoyed the visit to the Jumpman LA store. Um, the store was kind of weak this time, you guys. That's the first time I've ever been there without seeing a bunch of Jordan retros. Um, I was actually hoping those neon, those Jordan 4 neons would go on sale, but they didn't have any, so I guess they won't go on sale. That kind of bummed me out. But um, it is what it is, you guys. It is what it is. Let me know what you guys think about these uh, Jordan 4 metallic oranges. Let me know what you guys think about the review. Make sure you help your boy out. Press that like button if you enjoyed this video. Uh, if you're new to my channel, make sure you guys go ahead, press that subscribe button, click on that notification bell because I do drop a lot of videos. Uh, once again, thank you so much for watching, you guys. Thanks for making it to the end. See you guys next one. Peace.